Hi, I'm Henrik Batalones from the Supply Chain Management Association of the Philippines. Uh, we have been happy to have been tapped as a partner by Logisim for the first ever Logisim Philippines 2023. I am happy to have another opportunity for our members and for the Philippine supply chain industry at large to learn more from supply chain professionals from across our, from across our region, considering that we are on our continuing journey to further our competitiveness and it's always best to learn more from our, from our partners across the region to learn best practices, to get, understand innovations and to bring them home to our companies and we could apply them to our own operations. But I'm, one of the things that really struck me, not just today, but throughout the weeks leading up to this as we've been talking to the team at Logisim, is that it's really, collaboration is really important, that you cannot really do anything without, if you're, if you're just, you cannot really do anything if you're just standing alone, uh, doing things on your own. You really have to reach out to others because some will have something to offer that you don't and you will have something to offer that they don't. And when you, ha when you have these uh, different minds coming together, you have these different perspectives, different insights coming together, you will have, your sum will, the sum will be greater than its parts, I would say. So congratulations for the first edition and we're happy again to be part of it and I hope there will be many, many more so what I'm actually looking forward um, to the next Logisim in the Philippines would be um, they would actually put value more on those people on the ground and quite giving more programs for those people that are actually fulfilling uh, because everybody has actually been talking about the resilience. They've been talking about the food moving forward, but um, we would be uh, able to add more value to this if we would look back to those people that are actually working on the ground. My best takeaway on this one is when Dr. Christians talks about something that has to do when he actually gathered all the people that belongs to the shipper and then think about their thought and processes that they, they actually collaborate together. Um, this is going to be part that something that would really hear out those people that belong to this industry. And as I look forward to this one, this is quite very um, interesting and be very something that everybody would look forward to if our government will be supporting this part wherein they will integrate all those issues that they will identify and create programs for it that would all uh, logistic industry will be looking after for as they actually continue with this um, goal for us to do and be more advanced. Thank you. Hello, I'm Dr. G. Robledo from the Packaging Institute of the Philippines. And um, I'm very thankful that I was invited here at the Logism, Logism Forum by Globe, Global Link. Yes, uh, in here I tell you the forum was so engaging. I met a lot of people. Uh, we have, they have good speakers. I learned about AI. I learned about digital platforms and many things about logistics and supply chain, which uh, say, uh, a logistic practitioner should be equipped with. They have really great people to have network with and I'm so proud and I'm so happy that I am here. As for the innovations that I'm looking at, this, I think this exhibit has provided, is providing us with great innovations because um, the exhibitors really, they are they know well their products. They gave us um, state-of-the-art uh, projects, products like uh, the solar, the solar-operated vehicles, and um, and many more. So it would be very interesting, really, to participate to join this exhibit. I hope you will be in this exhibit soon. Thank you. Hello, everyone. I'm Annie Galang from AMS Osram. Uh, supply chain manager. Uh, AMS Osram is providing or a semiconductor having the IC, producing IC. Uh, well, Logisim, attending the Logisim is really helpful. Most especially we are on the uh, digitalization stage wherein there's a lot of system and process that we need the people engagement for the more improvement in supply chain goal and KPI. That's all I think that it would be helpful. I hope that everybody have uh, key points to remember, especially on the 
uh, cost savings and the sustainability as well as the uh, being resilient of every as a goal of in the supply chain. That's all. Thank you. First of all, Fast Logistics warmly welcomes Logisim to the Philippines for the first time um, as a program. What we our key takeaway was that we need to collaborate more and more. We take inspiration from uh, the Shippers Council that Dr. Raymond spoke about. So we want to do more collaborative work and definitely we will do this together with Logisim. Thank you.